Bearings are a critical component of production machines. Maintain them properly and be rewarded with a long and productive life cycle. Ignore simple concepts like appropriate lubrication and pay consequences that undermine your competitive advantage. Poorly lubricated bearings are a primary contributor of premature machinery failure. A common mistake is to grease bearings based on time intervals instead of condition. This wastes time and lubricant and contributes to over lubrication. Major bearing manufacturers claim that incorrect lubrication practices decrease the longevity of bearings by as much as 40%. Grease serves a simple purpose, to reduce friction and dissipate heat. Too much lubricant builds pressure inside the bearings. Too little creates excessive friction and heat. The result? Bearing fatigue, overheating, failure, and excessive energy consumption. Companies looking to optimize lubrication practices have adopted a conditional approach. By monitoring the friction levels of bearings with ultrasound, they can determine when the lubricant has deteriorated and needs replacement. Trending against an established decibel value, increased friction levels are quickly spotted and alarms triggered. It becomes a standard practice to sort good bearings from those that require the attention of the lubrication technician. Data collection is simple and not time consuming at all. Diagnosis is straightforward, allowing intervention well in advance of failure. The SDT270 ultrasound detector from SDT serves a dual purpose. In addition to alarming when friction levels need attention, loop techs listen to the bearing as new grease is applied. Using the SDT270's digital decibel metering as a guide, only enough grease is applied to return the bearing's friction level to normal. One stroke of grease more, and the damage of over-greasing enters the equation. Another common mistake everyone makes. There are three rules to follow for optimizing bearing lubrication. First, don't grease bearings based on time in service. Grease them because friction levels have started to increase, a sure sign that the lubricant is failing. Don't use listen-only ultrasound devices. Measuring friction levels requires the accuracy and repeatability of the digital SDT270 ultrasonic data collector. Whether predicting greasing intervals or actually applying new lubricant depend on the precision of SDT's digital decibel display to avoid over and under lubrication. Are you new to the concept of ultrasound assisted lubrication? Fear not, getting started is easy. Visit our website or call today to speak with an ultrasound service agent. We can answer all your questions, recommend the best product for your needs and budget, and schedule a live demonstration at your plant. There are lots of things you can do with an ultrasound program. Acoustic bearing lubrication monitoring in real time is just the beginning. Our promise to you is that no matter what your ultrasound goals may be, SDT will be right there beside you each and every step of your journey. So what are you waiting for? Let's hear more together today.